Hi everybody! After using the launch class button from LMS, I'm in a virtual classroom running Adobe Connect. The share window lists the topics that I will cover in this video. Ideally, you will have two monitors to use during your online class. They can be separate devices, such as a computer and a laptop, because it isn't necessary for them to be connected to each other. One of these screens will be used to display Adobe Connect, the software you are seeing now. Your instructor will be demonstrating the class lessons in the share window in the center of this screen where my outline is being displayed. You will use your other monitor to follow along with the exercises which have been placed on the remote computer in the classroom. It isn't necessary for you to have a copy of the software on your local machine. Once class begins, your instructor will display a live link to some online software called GoToMyPC. The instructor will also give you three pieces of information. They are in my chat window now. There will be a registered email address, a password to use as you log into your account, and an access code that will be needed to ultimately connect to your virtual computer. The link will be launched from Adobe Connect's chat window and will open a new window in your browser. You will see a sign in button in the upper right hand corner of your screen. Once clicking on the sign in button, you will see a spot for you to enter the information that was given to you by your instructor. This information is case sensitive. I'll type in my registered email address first. Then I'll click in the password field. My password does start with a capital letter. Then I'll click on the login button. If the software hasn't been run on your computer before, it will ask you to install it at the bottom of the screen. You will simply click on a login button on the button that says run and it will bring you to the screen that I'm on now. You will click on the gray connect button and once clicking on this gray connect button it will ask you to type in your access code. The access code is also case sensitive. Now I'm connected to my remote computer. At this time, you should move the window by the gray bar on the top to your other screen. Once inside the host computer, you will see a tools menu at the top of the screen. You will choose preferences from this menu. It will bring up a tab dialog box and if you are taking this class from a Mac computer, be sure to tell your instructor at the beginning of class because the Mac version of GoToMyPC does not allow you to access this dialog box. Your instructor will set the security settings for you before you start the login process and have you begin the login process after they disconnect from your machine. By default, if your mouse is idle for more than 15 minutes, you will be logged out of the remote computer. For this reason, you will change the timeout settings to avoid needing to log in again after your lunch break. In order to do so, 
you will choose the tab that says security and then change the number at the bottom from 15 to at least 75 minutes. The numbers change very quickly when you hold down the up arrow. It is not necessary if you hold it too long to reduce the settings. Then I'll hit OK and I'm ready to start my class. I hope you enjoy yours and I hope this helps you to connect to go to my PC.